now. Here are your latest headlines and updated Kansas City forecast from KSHB 41 News. I'm Dia Wall with KSHB 41 News. Here are your headlines. Right now, election day in the metro and the polls are still open. The big races today, the primary elections for mayor in both Overland Park and Kansas City, Kansas. Polls stay open until 7 o'clock tonight. Five people are running for mayor in KCK, including incumbent David Alvey. In Overland Park, four candidates are running for the position. The top two candidates in each race go on to the general election in November. No better of example of the explosion in cases of COVID like the state of Missouri, considered one of the worst states for new cases. New numbers show a jump in more than 50,000 cases from June to July. In May, the state only reported about 9,700 new cases. The state saw nearly 400 deaths in July, up from 268 in June. And while many areas across the country have called for new mask mandates, today the City of Independence announced it's lifting its mask order for indoor spaces. Meanwhile, in the legal fight today between Missouri's Attorney General and the cities and counties that have reinstated indoor mask mandates, today a judge ruled in favor of the state, issuing a temporary halt on the mandate in St. Louis County. But the order today did not impact the City of St. Louis's mask mandate. Here's Gary Lisak. Hey, Dia, we're looking at temperatures in the middle 80s tomorrow, 90s by the end of the week. We have a brand new severe thunderstorm criteria from the National Weather Service. We usually issue severe thunderstorm warnings. Now we're going to issue severe thunderstorm warnings, and then if it's more dangerous, it'll be a considerable thunderstorm warning. And if it's the worst type of severe thunders, then it'll be destructive severe thunderstorm warning, which would be baseball size hail and 80 mile per hour winds or stronger. Only 10% of severe thunderstorms are that strong. Most of them are the weaker severe thunderstorms and still could cause some damage. So just interesting, wanted to let you know that. I'm meteorologist Gary Lezak.